I just wanted to do a little video about what I bring with me when I travel. And um, we're just doing a little vacation in Virginia. I'm going to Washington, D.C. And uh, we're staying in Manassas, Virginia right now. We're going to go to some plantations, some Civil War battlefields and that kind of thing. So I'm just going to show you what I brought with me. Uh, because we did not fly, we actually did a road trip down here. I could pretty much bring anything, any size, so it really didn't matter. I probably could have put this... <laughs> my mouthwash into a smaller container but I just ran out of time and I rushed out of there and I just grabbed the bottle but that's fine because you know it's something you need every day um, toothpaste toothbrush obviously dental floss and then I just got a few things just to help me get through and this is my body wash I got this from Sephora it's Tuscan blood orange body wash and it's actually quite nice I mean I don't know if it's worth the money it was five dollars for this little bottle um but you know it's, it's not bad. For travel, it's fine. Uh, everything with me has to be whitening. I love white teeth, so um, I've got Arm & Hammer Advanced Whites, also travel size. Always bring my razor with me. Uh, I've been using this a lot. This is Antipodis uh, Skin Balm and good for your feet, legs, body. It's an um, antibacterial skin treatment, uh, skin remedy. Really, really nice. Makeup remover um, pads. This is the first time I've used these. And actually they're pretty good. There's not that many in here, I don't think. There's 30 in here. So, yeah, it's quite nice. I should store it upside down, I think. Now this stuff is really nice. This is the second one I'm using. Uh, this is Adara. Now, everyone who's seen my videos knows that I have a bit of an aversion to coconut. On occasion I can stand the smell with some things. This one in particular... I actually love the smell. It's very, very light coconut, but it's a peachy kind of scent. So this is really good stuff. You can use this to take off makeup. You can use this as a hair treatment, like a hair nourishment treatment. I think you can use it as a massage oil, um, uh, you know, as a body lotion. It's a multi-use um, product. You can get this on Hippopotheca, and they have different scents. Uh, it just really... Is, an unusual product, something that I've never actually encountered before that is so multi-purpose. So I'm enjoying that. And that's the other thing is I've been traveling with these. This is almost finished. It's my last one. This is my Mbizi Once Bitten Deodorant Stick. And it's a little mini one. You can actually put it in your pocket or you can put it in your pocketbook or purse handbag. Uh, and that's it. I did bring some blowout cream. Never used this before. I'm going to use it this morning for the first time. And it's supposed to be free of parabens, phthalates, synthetic colors, mineral oils, and petroleum. Uh, I really need something because my hair is frizzing up quite a bit over here. It's been raining and a little bit humid, which is strange for this time of year. Humidity. Uh, some aspirin. This is my little toiletry bag, and this is a Longchamp toiletry bag. I put all of that stuff in here, and you can see it just fits perfectly, except for the mouthwash. I love Longchamp. I'm going to be doing a video on this, uh, my Longchamp collection. I have just a few little things, but functional. I mean, it's just so beautiful. Look at this. It's quality. Uh, this is leather. It's just lovely. And, of course, hairbrush and hair tie. Hairband, I should say. And then this is also something that I discovered a while back, and I took this with me on my cruise. Perfect if you need to do laundry while you're traveling. Sometimes you may actually need to do a whole load of laundry, and you can use this for that. Or you sometimes would just want to do a hand wash if you spill something on a blouse, or, or if you want to wash your underwear or something. And here are four different laundry detergents by Toka. And uh, they smell heavenly. And so if you, for like a machine wash, you'd use half a bottle. For a hand wash, you only need a few capfuls. But very, very handy. Perfect for delicates. And uh, just a really nice little travel bag to keep everything in there. So always taking this with me now wherever I go, just in case I do need to wash something. So this is my Furla makeup bag, and I think this is called Patchouli. Yes, this is the Patchouli color. 
and it's an orange color so perfect for fall and in here I keep things for nails you can see in here everything for my nails because I love painting my nails and doing my nails and all that stuff there's a nail buffer and a bloom nail file I love that one I think it's very difficult to find bloom in the US anymore I think they used to sell it at Sephora years ago but you don't really get that anymore this is so handy this is from Sally's Beauty Supply and it has little like a little grit on the end so you really can get in there and clean up your nails and make sure there's no dead skin I have my OPR base coat this is an SE top coat oh and this is called super duper top coat and it makes everything very glossy so you have like really glossy nails you can see it works really well these are antibacterial nail polish remover pads and this is polish off just like the Deborah Lipman ones but cheaper and I have my nail trimmers and this is nail polish here yeah. I always mark them because then I know which is the older one that I don't get them mixed up here are some more nail implements cuticle pushes you know nail scrapers that kind of thing and then the color that I'm wearing, I only bought this with me because I have no intention of changing this color right now. And this is Chanel's particular. And it matches my whole brown theme and my brown kick that I'm on at the moment. Okay, and so that's everything. I think I'm going to have to split this stuff up into another video because they're just handbag reviews because they were so helpful to me when I travel. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, definitely some ideas about how to sort of pack a decent amount of makeup but not go overboard. And I learned the lesson for myself <laughs> in, the, in all of this. Uh, I definitely used all these nail things I, because I did my nails when I got here. I just didn't have time to get my nails done before I left for vacation. So I've used all this stuff already. And if I have any chips or any issues, it's easy to just take the polish off.